Tyson, Tyson, Jordan, Game 6. Hey y'all, so before we start this video, I just wanted to give a huge thank you to PDF Elements for sponsoring today's video. And PDF Elements Pro definitely helped me so much during my law school orientation week with navigating documents. I highly recommend you all use it, and here's how it works. Okay, so here's my little setup here. Um, it might change, I don't know, I've been kind of going all over the place. But a lot of the times, you're I actually pretty much all the time, like you're gonna be doing stuff on your computer. You take your exams on your computer and everything. And um, if you don't have the book or you have a PDF or just any assignment online, I highly recommend using something that you can edit your PDFs with and why not edit them with PDF Element. How I used it was whenever we would get readings, um, I would just upload them straight to the application. And as you can see, you can just kind of edit them. So here's a memo we were given to read and I'll just show you all how PDF Elements Pro makes marking up your text like pretty seamless, honestly. So first, you can annotate, and this is important, of course, for any type of thing. So I just like to use it to circle key important things. I don't know, something that I want to point out that I might forget in the future. You can also underline. I mean, they have a ton of features that you can use, like literally anything you can think of, you can do it here. Um, I also like added a little sticky note, just a reminder, and you can also highlight, which you can see I highlighted a ton here. I actually have like different versions of this document where I highlight different colors, but in this one, it's just some simple highlighting I did. But actually my favorite thing about PDF Elements Pro is the OCR capability. This is literally like revolutionary. Like PDF Elements Pro allows you to use OCR to make your PDF searchable. Do you under, this is so useful because you're able to search certain terms. Like, so I won't have to search through or comb through tons of cases. I can search a specific term and then on the right tab, as you can see, Every time that term comes up, I'm able to see it. So that definitely is going to save me so much time. Um, you're also able to, of course, convert your PDF into other files. So you'll be fine with changing things into whatever format your professor prefers. And even under the forum tab, there's all sorts of tools you can use for things even outside of class, just for regular life, like your digital signature, um, for documents, and things like that. So there are definitely tutorials free download links and discount links down in the description box below so be sure to check them out and without further ado let's see how my law school orientation week went so good morning y'all and yes i still do not have a lamp anyways um it's my first day of orientation and everything is going crazy so we got some readings that we were supposed to be doing before class I'm like, oh, okay, like I'm in Martha's Vineyard at the time, so I'm really not in the school mind, so I'm trying to get my last, you know, vacation. I get back. I did the first reading. It wasn't so bad, and I still have to do one more reading. Class starts at 9.15. It's 8.56 right now. I got up. Of course, I'm out of hair, Joe. I had to just finesse this little bun. Then the mouse to my computer is dead, of course, today of all days. And I had never charged it before, so I had to figure out how to charge it. It's currently charging, so hopefully it has enough battery. I also have a presentation for my job. Yes, I'm still working because I'm mm, getting this free money here. So, um, and that starts at 10. So I'm going to just take like a five minute break during orientation. That's my plan. Let's hope this goes well. Let's see. But, um, yeah, I'm usually idle on that call anyways. Then I haven't eaten. I don't know how to work this Keurig, y'all. I've been trying. Nothing is coming out of this damn Keurig. So, you know, we're off to a chaotic start. I also don't know what to wear. Like, they're saying business casual. I'm kind of like, y'all, is it really that deep? We're at home. But um, I cannot find any shirts. You know when you come back from a trip, like, most of your stuff is, like, kind of all over the place. Either that or it's dirty. This Keurig is just not working. <laughs> So, I can't even drink any coffee. I'm tired as heck. And I think it's just too late for me to go to Starbucks. Like, it's 8.57. Um, I'm kind of running around here. I don't have any pants on. My camera's about to die. I just wanted to let y'all know, it's we're off to a chaotic start. Okay? I'll be back. <laughs> so, I never got my Keurig to work. But anyway, so this is the shirt I'm wearing. <laughs> on the bottom is for sure sweats. <sighs> my house is a mess right now. But anyways... Listen, like they have a little music for us. I'm trying not to vlog while I'm on camera, but this is like the little setup. Yes, I have my little plate there I was eating. And then I have like my ring light here to improve the lighting. I'm still navigating this apartment. I need to just decide on a lamp so I can fix that. But um, yeah, we'll see. Also, I don't know if I told you, but I went to Starbucks. So I'm actually just going to put the order in and I'm just going to go. 
I've decided that it's worth it to just be gone for like maybe 15 minutes. I don't think I'll miss too much, so yeah. Okay, y'all, so it's time for my first class. I'm actually kind of late. I'm in the waiting room for this lady to let me in, but I had to get this moment. Oop, I'm in here. Here's the class, and I'm gonna be taking notes on my laptop. Um, I'm kind of out of breath, y'all, because I am nervous too. But okay. Okay, I'm gonna top this <laughs> because you know it's the last week to have fun, so why not? <laughs> And then you, okay, so these are some type of green tea shots. Never heard of it. I was not about to try it. Skinny shots, matcha. Oh, okay. Jalen gulped it. Okay, Aaliyah gulped it. So does it taste good? Okay. Okay, hey y'all, it's day two of orientation. And even though I said yesterday was a hot mess, today I feel like it wasn't even a hot mess, but somehow I was just all over the place. Anyways, at least I could get up on time today. And it was just, um, like I said, they have um, dress codes for us. So today's like rep your undergrad. Y'all already know this hoodie, come on now. I wear this like all the time, but anyways. So far, I, I think it's not too, too bad. I will say I'm already over the whole Socratic method thing. Like, sometimes it can just get kind of unproductive. Like, you're just asking petty stuff. Like, and then I lose focus because, you know, I'm struggling with the focus. But anyways, um, I'm about to make some lunch. We had class from 9 to 12 today. <sighs> it's um it's 12.30. Half my lunch already gone because I have to go to the mail room. Because I got HelloFresh, y'all. Well, I'm not even about to promote them because I want them to sponsor me, but I'm about to make lunch. I'm about to, I need to clean. I need to clean my kitchen um, and then make lunch. And then I finally got... Oh, I got this welcome mat. I'm going to show y'all a little preview. I... Okay, yeah, this is... Bitch, don't wear no shoes for mom. I finally decided on a lamp, so uh, I think my mom is going to pick that up for me today. And then I want to get the smart light bulbs. Like, I want a whole vibe in here. Okay, I'm investing a lot in this apartment because I'm like, I'm in here 24-7. So, yeah, I want to get the... So, the lamp should be... I got it, like, two days ago. I just haven't picked it up from Target. And then... I want to put my posters up because my wall is so blank. Here, we're about to play this game. It's actually pretty interactive, y'all. Like, I feel like for an online setting, like, we really, the chatter, the banter, it's good. I'm chewing gum because my lunch had hella onions in it. But let me turn my camera back on just to give y'all a little update. I just ran to the bus on the Literally, I don't even jaywalk. Like, if more than eight people come, I'm gonna lose my job. It's 16. It's hella people. Like she said, this is a kickback. It is a lot of people here. See what I say? It was literally easier to get tested for Corona, like faster and easier actually. And to get that shirt. So yeah, I need to take a nap. Okay, hey y'all. So I just got back from doing those little errands or whatever. We ended up also going to CVS because I just needed little things. Um, finally back. My apartment is a hot mess. Like, it's so much crap all over the place because I never really unpacked from Martha's Vineyard. I still didn't really unpack from just moving in here from UCLA. So I'm going to try to do all that today. What time is it? Because let's see. I'm gonna do, okay, it's 5.39. Okay, go. Okay, I'm gonna take a break. I'm gonna see where I get to by seven. 
30 because I want to take a nap and then I have three cases to read for class tomorrow okay you all will probably hear the dishwasher in the background mm. Mm. I usually do not like to eat and read like I'm more of an eat and watch something type of person but I feel like now I'm just gonna have to change it eat and read because I'm gonna be reading all the time like <laughs> <laughs> whatever oh and i need like my laptop I, or something because like as i read and i see words that i don't know i just look them up right away so yes well y'all i look a mess per usual but honestly i don't really be caring i just wanted to say it is 10 14 i finished um like three out of the readings, three out of four, the four readings. They really weren't that bad, but my friend just texted me this saying, I don't know who needs to see this, but please stop stressing over orientation assignments and enjoy this time off. Stop staying up all night doing law school orientation assignments, about to burn yourself out before the race even starts. This was Jesus speaking to me. So on that note, the mullet versus Bradley case will be an issue of tomorrow. I finished all the other ones though. Like I wouldn't say I'm burning myself out, but I just wanted to kind of get in the swing of reading. You know, I'm literally coming fresh off of um, vacation. So I'm just gonna be having my lavender. Y'all can't see the mist, but I need my aromatherapy. And I'm probably just gonna be watching Moesha. See y'all tomorrow. Okay, good morning y'all. So I guess this is day three of orientation. It's Wednesday and it's about 7.45 in the morning. I need to buy highlighters. I know y'all are probably like, Jordan, how do you not have highlighters? I don't know. Like I thought I had some just in my backpack, but they're gone. And the highlighter I was using, it's running out of ink. Like I can't read with that dry as highlighter. So <clears throat> I'm gonna go to CVS and um, get highlighter. Dang, there's one. Other thing. I said I was gonna write it down. I think thumbtacks and see if they have a calendar because I've been using this whiteboard calendar, but I actually want another one that I can put like on another wall that's paper. And I'm gonna try to find a notebook. So I need to write all that down. Let me just write that down right now. I bought this little cute um, notepad thingy from Target that has like to do, do it now, do it later. Um, I'm gonna do it now. Let me write this stuff down. Oh, I need to start laundry. So it's 7:53. The CVS near me doesn't open till nine, so I'm walking kind of further to a different one. And then I want to try to go to CVS, buy all that stuff, start a little laundry all before class starts at nine. Do y'all think I can do it? Do y'all faith in? It's coming together. Okay, it's coming together. But this lamp, I built it wrong. Like, I'm pretty sure there's not supposed to be wire exposed here. So, um, hopefully my mom or someone comes to help me fix it. But I really do like these lights because, because if you just take this little handy dandy app, only one of them does it. I need to get more. Yeah, but like change the mood. Okay, okay. I think I'm feeling blue today. Feeling blue. Let me go down. Let me go to CVS. This is how I get late. Just rambling. Okay, so I'm at CVS. Thank goodness. I left a little earlier because it's raining outside. But here we have some highlighters. I'm gonna just get these. So some people are like, oh, law school, they write on these. I just feel like if I write on this, I will lose these papers. Like I feel like a notebook will just keep all that together. So I think I'm just gonna get an actual notebook. How <laughs> oh, did I end up spending $45 on this? Okay, y'all, class has started, but thank goodness because it's technical, they gave us like a little grace period. I'm just gonna show y'all the school supplies I got real quick. I literally spent $50 at CVS. I'm so upset, but I got some folders. Okay, I got this notebook. Like I said, in CVS, I didn't think I would really need um, school supplies like that in law school. I thought it'd be like undergrad, like I just use my laptop, but no, you need a notebook. Legal pads, I cannot, I feel like I will lose all those pages. So I just got a notebook. Okay, I thought that was a professor. And then I got these highlighters and I got some cute pins and I got coffee because these long days, bro. Anyways, let me get to sitting down and actually get to work. In class, but making bacon. 
And so, and, and what do you assess that the decision considerate? What are the two policy considerations? This is too much. This is too much. I don't under. Um, not even talking about class really. Like, okay, today I actually followed the class pretty well. Like, would if she called on me, like I would be okay. But thank God she didn't. Keep praying. But um, all these little administrative things, like you got to set up all these accounts, like to get the assignments. I'm like. <laughs> I don't know. UCLA was just so different. Like we had a portal, class websites, all this. I'm not used to hearing about twins, simplicity, all this stuff. Like I do not, I don't know. And I actually need to do better at reading my emails because I just skimmed through them. But like, let me, let me stop my rant. But anyways, let's just take a moment and my curl pattern is coming back y'all. Like what texture is coming in? So shout out to Aaliyah for the cut. But yeah, I had to just leave class. Um, she was just talking about random questions people were asking. I'm about to make lunch, not even make lunch. I'm just gonna reheat. I didn't finish the Thai food. So I'm gonna reheat that, eat that. Probably take a nap, um, honestly. I think I'm just gonna save the administration's admin, uh, the admin stuff for later. I don't know. <laughs> Y'all, I really cannot stop listening to this song. There's some holes in this house. At first I didn't like it, but now I'm like, there's some holes in this house. Okay, that's it. Okay, y'all, a lot has happened. As you can see, I even have like some random stuff on the wall. I've just been playing with my apartment. Anyway, so I built the shoe thing. I also built this thing right here. Um, you know, nothing is really done in here, and like I said, I'm gonna do an apartment tour, but honestly, I really thought I would, I didn't think it would take me this long to move into a freaking apartment. But I don't think that apartment tour is gonna come until probably 2021 at this rate. But anyways, um, I still haven't started any of these orientation readings, but everyone is telling me like it's not a big deal, so I'm, I might skim them, I might not. If I get called on tomorrow, I don't even know what the hell to do. Um, I also ordered all my books. Um, one of the reasons I chose Howard is because everyone was like, oh, like, you're gonna get a mentor, and sometimes you don't even have to buy books. I've not gotten a mentor yet, and, um, I kinda, I don't wanna say I'm, like, I had, like, kind of, like, a flustered moment, so I called one of my friends who's, um, about to go into her second year of law school, and she was like, girl, what are you doing? Buy your books. Like, what are you talking about? So, I decided to just buy them. And um, I tried to call the store to see if I could return them if like I end up not needing them. Hmm, no one answered. So whatever. So I just, after building all that stuff and cleaning, I also kind of changed my desk around. But now my desk is facing my bed. Oh my god, it's sliding. But now my desk is facing my bed. And then my friend is like, no, you don't want to face your bed because you're going to get tired. I'm just over this whole day. My goodness. Um, so I was going to cook because you know I have my Hello Fresh, But I ended up just making these ratchet, um pizza bagels. Cause that's literally the only thing I can make in like 10 minutes. And bitch, I made me a drink because it has just been a long stressful day and everyone is telling me, don't even stress out right now. Like just drink, just turn up while you can. Enjoy your free time. I'm the last person that needs to hear that. Y'all already know I live life like that already. But you know what? Whatever. But yeah, today was actually a very overwhelming day. They were talking to us about the bar. I am not trying to hear about the bar right now. Like, I hadn't even bought my textbooks and they're trying to tell me how much to save to pay for the bar. Oh my gosh, that was just so annoying. But anyways, um, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I wanted to go out, like I wanted to go to a restaurant or something, but I'm actually gonna wait for my um, corona results before I go anywhere, so yeah. But um, I'm just gonna stay in. I guess I'll just like watch a show, I guess, read, but so far i'm kind of overwhelmed oh another thing i did i ordered a bunch of stuff on amazon like i ordered everything i needed for my apartment well probably not everything but like literally basically everything besides freaking plants like i ordered so much stuff um because my friend was like just get everything out the way like everything every little thing you can think of like just do everything before you start because once you start you're not gonna have time for any of that so the only thing i didn't really do was laundry but um you know i have a few more days or I have, literally have to but um okay this is like a really long rant oh my god yeah so far day three of law school orientation this shit is getting real okay it's getting real okay good morning y'all um wait let me turn my 
little podcast off. Okay, so um, I'm actually gonna end the vlog here because it's just been a long week and I feel like y'all are probably not that interested. I mean, I don't know if you're interested, but um, it's just day four of orientation. It's actually 7 a.m. I got up at 5.30 today randomly. Like, it was definitely Jesus who worked, woke me up because I went to bed pretty late, but um, I'm about to do laundry in my building for the first time. I had to get my laundry card and my mom got me this cute little um, laundry bin. So... I'm just gonna get my life together y'all it's a lot going on i am not gonna lie like i've cried <laughs> multiple times during this week but um yeah thank y'all for watching and let's see where this journey takes us i look very crazy right now but seriously all of y'all's encouraging messages like they really mean so much and we're gonna see because this is literally like the first time people well i don't want to say first time because i feel like we've had pandemics before right you know the whole flu but this whole online thing going to law school online like i don't know if i want to be the first group of people to do it i really don't know but hey <sighs> all right let me not end like that okay bye y'all <laughs>